School Free Wars Q Basic Tutorial Series, Tutorial 53, Gorillas, Nibbles, OpenGL, Games, and Other Program Examples. This tutorial will use QB64 version 1.1 running on Windows 8.1. The code is available at qb64.net in the QB64 zip file. Here is the QB64 zip file unzipped, and inside we have the application and the programs folder. Inside of the programs folder we'll find samples, and inside of samples we'll find the code for OpenGL examples, games, and other files, including the gorilla, frog, or frogger, and the nibbles. Nibbles and gorilla have been ported to QB64. Also, we have the PEAT folder, which includes multiple games and other programs. So let's take a look at a few of these, just as an example. I'll go to QB64. File open. I'll go to the QB64 programs, followed by samples. Now let's take a look at gorillas. So I'll go to miscellaneous. Go to Gorilla64. Here is the source code. Many people are looking for the source code for gorillas, and here it is. Already ported to QB64. You can go through it as you choose. I'll go ahead and just run gorillas, and we'll take a look at the game. Okay, you can make the screen bigger by hitting Alt-Enter. Uh, let's put in the information here. We see the wind is strong to the right. Start off with an angle of 70 and a velocity of 55. Increase that velocity a little bit. All right, there we are. Okay, let's take a look at some other things that are available to us. I'll go to File and Open. I see that we have chess there. You can take a look at many of these things on your own. Let's try Nibbles, which is a very famous game. There it is. Again, we see the source code, and we can go and view it and scroll through it. I'll go ahead and run this. Let's take a look at Nibbles. Again, you can make this larger by hitting Alt-Enter. I have one player, skill level of one, and sure, color, yes. Basically, Nibbles is just a snake game. All right, I'll just close this down. Let's take a look at some other things. Let's go to File Open. We have some fractals. I'll choose this one. Go ahead and run that. And there it is, okay. Let's take a look at some other folders here. I'll go back to the samples folder. Let's take a look at Pete, and inside we have the Invader game, so I'll just go to Invader 1, and there's the Invader game there. Go ahead and run. To move the shooter back and forth, we press Alt or Control, and Shift 
fires are shot. And as good practice, if you want, you can always change the code to your liking. So if you don't like using the control and alt key, you can change that around. Okay, let's take a look at a few other things. Let's go to file and open. I'll go back to the samples folder and let's take a look at OpenGL. Simple example. All right, I'll go ahead and run this. And there's QB64 running OpenGL. Nice little graphic there. You can make some nice OpenGL games, I suppose. Let's take a look at the other example. It's actually pretty smooth. Okay, so there are hundreds upon hundreds of programs in the samples folder for you to take a look at it. Not all of them work well, not all of them run well either, but I would suggest taking a look at those in there, going through the code, and even trying to make the program better based upon making some modifications to the application source code.